Guys, so today, oh, hold on, let me fix, no, no hype. So basically, we're going to do Lumion Legacy hype to no hype alignment chart. So basically, a Lumion up here will be no, more hype, but also I made it so like the good Lumions are over here and the bad Lumions are over here, just to so, show the correlation between hype and good and how viable it is. So yeah. I, th I think this will be interesting. Starting off with Seer Knight. This thing is not hype at all. It, it It's not hype. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's used as a tank. Nobody finds it hype. I'm basing this off of when you see it in a battle. You're like, woo! Or boo. And this is a boo. This one's not hype. But it's really good. I have to give it that. Lumi is not very hype. And it's not as great this meta. I still think it's... Not terrible. I think it's still on the good side of things. So I'm going to put it right here, but it's not hype. Well, actually, yeah, I want to put it like right here. But most pe Some people are running the offensive Lumi now, which is kind of hype in my opinion. Tad Tab, pretty hype to see. I mean, always fun seeing it like do stuff, like sweep and that stuff. So I'd say it's pretty hype. Also really good, this meta. Valkyrie... Not this that good. It's definitely worse than Lumi. Probably like right in this. But it's also really hype. I mean, it's Valkyrie. Come on now. How do you not get hyped when seeing it? Vesperatu, the worst starter this meta due to the amount of clips in this meta. But it's still pretty hyped. Like yesterday, I watched a Vesperatu sweep. Granted, the other guy sold, but still, Vesperatu, pretty hype. Ember. Yeah, I, I, I use Himber, and personally, it's the most hype thing ever. Not the most, but, like, I still think it's pretty hype. It's not great, this meta, though. Zulong, I mean, not the most hype offensive Lumion. I'd still say it's, like, no hype means, like, kind of tank wall. This is, I think, a little bit above kind of hype, you know. Umbrat, you get hyped when you see Umbrat, but it's... The worst Lumi in this meta. Umbrat easily up here. Luxor. A little better than Umbrat, but still, like, it's pretty hyped to see. I argue, I'd argue it's more hyped than Umbrat, because you know it'll actually do something in some way. It's Eclipse. Not really as offensive as, because most people run defensive. And on it, it's so used, this meta. It's just not hype. It's like... Over 50% of people used to clip statistically. It's not that hype. I'd, I'd, I wouldn't put it, or I'd put it in the middle, yeah. I know, I can English. Um, Cinemoth, terrible, but still, you know, most, like, Lumians like these. Lumians with, like, Route 1 Lumians that are meant to be offensive but suck are the most hype things ever. And Cinemoth is one of them. And Cinemoth, like, it's, it'd be pretty funny to see it sweep someday. But for now, I'll put it here. Sumobito. Also, not as bad as these three, but let's put it right here. Again, like, it's hype. Most bad Lumians are, that are offensive are hype. Because, you know, you never get to see them. It'll be interesting to see them sweep and whatnot. So, that's a that's one of the main correlations. Avitross, I wouldn't say, is as hype. Mainly because they ruined the design. But n no design bias. Um, I still don't think it's as hype as these. But it's still pretty bad. But I still think it's hype. In a sense. Swolder. Like, you, you never know if it's ran offensively or defensively. It's on the worst side of the meta due to the amount of wind tricks and that stuff. So I'd put Swolder right here. Florent, pretty bad. Also not that hype because you know it just sits there. You know, yeah. Put it like right here. Um, Terrafly. I, I on it, honestly, everyone forgets about Terrafly when they see it. They're like, yeah, that thing's going to die. I mean, that's what they say about these, but Terrafly, I mean, I just don't think it's as exciting. Terraclaw sucks. 
no hype to it. You just know it's going to sit there and tank. Dragoon, on the other hand, it's really hype to see just the burglar thing be used on against Stahl. It's very fun to see. But again, it's just not that great. Borok. Borok. Um, definitely right here in terms of how good it is. In terms of hype. I'd put it like right here. You're like, cool, Borok. But you're not going to be like, that's going to do some work right there. El Iguana. Not hype. It's... Main, it's mainly used in UU stall. Um, no hype to it. Also pretty bad in terms of OU. And it also is a fat tank in OU as well. No hype. Pretty bad. Put it right here. Gas stroke. Worse. Like literally take Florent. But just. It's, it's just Florent worse. Can't, just sits there and be fat. Same with WikiWiki, Wiki, except for the bequeath thing is kind of cool, so I'll put it slightly above Gastroke. Um, Chartiki sits there and becomes a, and is just a tank. No hype to it. You know it's everyone runs the defensive set. And yeah, Barter Ash, boo. Wakalaka, again. It's pretty hype, I'm just saying. Like, if Wakalaka can get in and... You destroy, like, literally every Lumion that's a threat to it. Can be pretty hype. I'd say Waka's right here. Shashi. Like, here's the thing about these common offensive Lumions. You just know that they're going to do things. Like, yeah. I, I want to put it right here. Seti, really good. Fat tank. So, probably, this is probably the least hype Lumion in the game, in my opinion. Seti Mars is the least hype Lumion. You, no one gets hyped when they see Seti. Not even star advocates get hyped when they see it. Vent, no hype. Worst Tsukame. Like, literally can't do anything right there. Um, I'm not including Ubers. Your snack sucks this meta because you know why. Um, also, no hype. You just know it's going to baffle into like Colossotrops or something. So I'm going to put it like right here. Revenine. I mean, it's fun to see if Rev can kill, I guess. It's pretty nice. Also, Rev is really good. Put Rev like right here. Erupted on, I mean, personally, my Erupted on set, very hype. My Erupted on set is the best Erupted on set, because Accelerate, Magnify, Combustible, you got all that jazz. It's pretty hype. Most Erupted ons, you know they're going to run out of gas if they run Pyro. Like, honestly, I'd put it like right here. Krakaloa. Again, not hype, not great this meta down here. Volcaloa, very hype, not very good though. Put it, I think it's better than one. I think I'd put it right here. Festifer. Mm. Probably right there. Epsidragon, good, but no hype. Like you're like, uh, you're like, can be hype when it sets up Drudge and starts body crashing away. Other than that, it's whatever. Trumbull, pretty hype to see, but you know it's not doing anything because it sucks right here. Mutoon, better than Trumbull. And pretty hype right here. Gob, probably the least hype thing on hyper offense. Because you know it just sets up barbs and dies. It's not hype at all. You're just like, whoa, Gob dies. Woohoo. Yeah, Gob is... But it's really good. So. 
I used to go. I mean, Icicle is a tricky one because you know it sucks, but the way you use it can determine how hype it is. Like when you see that Bane of Haste setup, very hype to see what they'll use. So I'm going to put it right here. Pharaoh, always nice to see. Pretty good as well. I want actually put it right here. Garbantis, not that great in the meta. But also, it's hype. Like, not extremely hype. It's kind of a melee tank. But also, hits hard back. You know, Strat. You know how I said Seti was the least hype? Strat's the second least hype. So I'm putting it right, right here. Dyborg. You know, everyone gets hyped when they see Dyborg. They're like, woo, Dyborg. Woohoo. At least a year ago, I don't know what happened. Dyborg's still pretty fun to see. Um, sucks, though. Right there. Rex. No, Power Draw set would be up here. But their basic set would be... So Rex is right here. Rex is right here in terms of hype. Munch Wheel. Spec, spec is pretty... Spec and Rev Up both can be pretty exciting to see just Munch Wheel um, do something. And then probably put it right here. Guard Drone. Probably like right here. You'll be like, oh, that's a Guard Drone. Pretty nice. Hunter. And then I changed my mind about Gobademic. Hunter is the least type because it's always used on Semi Stall. Also, it just RNGs, which is not hype. That is like, boo, you RNG'd. Even though RNG stands for remember not giving up. Um, Arapaigo. I don't know what it is. It's just not as hype as most things up here. I don't know. Most most people don't run Arapaigo at all. But when they do, I think it's tanky. I'd put Arapaigo right here. Hmm. Uh, Skellic. I think Skellic's actually not that bad in this meta. Also, pretty hyped to see. Because it can sweep. Joltooth. Amazing. Not amazing in how good it is. Amazing in how hype it is. Easily right here. Infernix. Boring tank. Whatever. Dorogo. Ace Dorogo is pretty hype to see, but Dorogo overall is really bad. Mawamurk, only used on stall. Boring, whatever. Right here. Oh, I guess it grabbed Barblast. Because it, it, it felt bad for Mawamurk, so they wanted to see Barblast. Barblast is right here, no hype at all. Metatoad. No, Metatoad can be pretty fun to see, especially Spectoad. That's pretty epic. I think I'd put it right here. Lotox, not good this meta, but whenever Warm 5 would owner with it, it was really hype. I know some of you might not understand what that means, but just look up on or Warm Kano's video and how he swept someone with a Blotox. That was really exciting to see. Blotox still sucks, but I'd give it like right here. Garlash. Worse Hunter, I guess. I, I don't know what to... Garlash just doesn't generate hype for people, and it's was in the middle of Lumion ever. Um, Delu. Delu's hype. I think Delu's hype. It's not great at... The meta, though. I think I'd put it right there. Colossotrops. This thing's really hype if it can get a Braum boost off with Bane of Haste. Um, Vigorous, you know. Not as terrible as some other things in the meta. Hogganosh. Sucks. Mainly used as a tank. But sometimes can be used off of that. I think I'd just put it right here. Mocho. Mocho's pretty hype to see because, you know... 
Smush is actually not that bad either. I think it's clear right here. It's breezy, boring, used as a tank. Just does fat things most of the time. Whipple Drift. Queet stuff's pretty cool, and sometimes it can sweep because of glide. You know? I gotta play it right here. Servalin, worst Varilution, worst Trumble, worst Borok, worst everything. It's just. I gotta put it right here. Wendo. Wendo generates some hype, I think. I personally think it would be right. Here. Kiro. When it doesn't miss, it's pretty hype seeing hit it hit everything, but if it misses, yeah, that sucks. Missing in general is really bad. Zephelin, one of the most hype Lumians everybody calls. Everyone thinks Zephelin is hype. Um, right there. Venelin, uh, on the contrary to Zephelin. Not hype. Resso can generate hype. But, I mean, kind of gets walled by every spirit, you know. Buzzo, I mean, haven't seen much of it. It's not great. Probably right here. Tundra, easily right here. Tundra's easily right here. Yeah, everything down here you know, you can agree with, it's not hype. Pyro. Um, Fanning Flame and Volcanic are both exciting to see. So, those two abilities combined make it actually pretty hype to watch, but it's pretty in the middle f in the, for the meta. Oxidrake, not hype, just spams Driving Force right here. Harvesect. It's really hard to determine what Harvesect is, but I think I think it goes right in the middle right here. Wintrix. I mean, again, it's usually used on semi stall, so I think I'll put it right here. Snagoop, Barter Goop, Epic. You know. That that's it really. Snagoo, I think it's right here. Sukame. It's, it's boring because it got rejuvenate instead of sea song. No. It's it's better vent and can actually do damage on like vent. It's right there. Banfino. <laughs> Who doesn't love Banfino, man? Banfino's really hype. It's also not that terrible in the meta. Kanibo, also really hyped to see it sweep. I think Kanibo is one of the most hype Lumians in my opinion. And it's also not terrible. i put it right here. Um, Samarine, this thing can sweep really well. It's pretty nice. Lumello, it's a poor thing. Like, here's the thing. You don't even know what to think when you think of Lumello. You're like, what, what, what? I think Lumelo's right here. Um, Taoshinu. Way too passive and used only on stall. Like, right here. Lyricat. Like I said, worse Mutoon, but it's also hype like Mutoon, so right here. Elef or Boonary. Simple. I don't even need to explain myself. Elephage. Um, it's kind of hard because Elephage does suck, but like, I don't know. I don't really care when Elephage comes. Duskit. My Duskit is hype. Obviously, everything I use is hype, but... Most Duskit users are Hypno Spammers, so that really knocks it down. Ikazune. It's fine, whatever. Pretty hype, yeah. Proto 
pretty hype. It sucks also. Mutagon banned. Several banned it. Wobblisk. I'm sorry. I just don't get hyped when I see it. I just see it as a fat barb setter. Honestly, it's just a fat barb setter. It's not that hype. Nimare. Nimare is not bad, but it's not exactly the hypest thing. Cosmior encased. It's not great. No hype to it. Cosmior cracked. It's really good. Probably the it's the best Cosmior. Um, I think it goes right, right here because it's pretty hard to see. Then this thing has so much potential. Like this thing, this thing right here, so much potential because surrogate is just one of the most hype abilities in the game. Like honestly, Nevermare. Nevermare. It's kind of annoying to crit, but like makes up for it with its terrible moves. Nevermare can get hype with Rageful Plushie. Let's see, it's right there. And Oculos. Everyone gets excited when they see Oculos, and I do too. But it's not great. Can wall win tricks, that's about it. But yeah, that's my hype to good, bad ratio, whatever you want to call it. My alignment chart for hype, but also adding good to bad because it makes it more interesting in my opinion. Yeah, see you later. Bye.